What's up guys, Beast the Gamer here, welcome to the channel. Today I want to talk to you guys about something that used to be very, very personal to me. Something that I loved to uh, partake in, something that was a guilty pleasure of mine, something that I've, I've been a part of for years. That is Podcast Beyond. That's right, IGN's PlayStation Podcast. What it used to be was an amazing podcast with very knowledgeable and likable characters. Greg Miller and Colin Moriarty were the peanut butter and jelly of IGN. They work so well together and they're the polar opposites of one another. One's a political uh, guru who loves politics, no-nonsense, intelligent guy. The other is a very loud and outspoken, likable lug. And, and that's what the two are to me. Very likable guys. I love Colin and Greg. I still love Colin and Greg. I'm a big fan of the Kind of Funny channel. I love their Game Over Greggy show. Uh, I love everything they do. But... I got really hooked on Colin and Greg initially because of Podcast Beyond. I'm sure lots of you guys have listened to this podcast. It was just very, very on point, to the point, with enough laughs to keep you engaged for that hour, hour and a half, however long they went. Unfortunately, uh, the podcast did come to an end with Colin and Greg as they moved on to Kinda Funny and their new ventures in life. And at episode 381 was their last episode. And that was a very, uh, very emotional episode for them, for the for the viewers. I actually teared up watching that episode uh, and listening to it. You know, uh, listening to Colin and Greg give their final farewells to the podcast Beyond community. And I, I you know, I took my hat off to the guys. I was very, very uh, happy to see what they were going to be doing next. I wanted, uh, you know, more uh, conversations with Colin. I wanted more of them. Period. So I was really excited to see what they were going to come up with. I didn't know they were going to do all the things they've done today, which is extremely good. And I'm happy that they've done. But at the same time, it was bittersweet because I was wondering what was going to happen with my love, my beloved podcast beyond. They were from all outward appearances. Colin and Greg had left the throne for Marty Sleva. That's what they said. That's the way IGN made it appear. That Marty Sleeve was going to be taking over the throne of Podcast Beyond. He would bring over new guests and new hosts and add his own flavor to it. Now, Marty Sleeve, he's a kind of likable guy. You know, uh, he's not as likable to me as Colin and Greg, but he's, he's okay. But what happened after Colin and Greg left Podcast Beyond was an abomination. They put Max Scoville in the lead chair. That's what it appears like. People still think that uh, Marty is the leader. No, I think that they put Max in that lead position the same way they did with Greg's other show. Uh, and this guy is just not, he does not have it. <laughs> Max Colville is the most unlikable character I've ever seen at IGN. Uh, he is, he wants to be funny and he's not. He lacks passion. When I say that, I mean that, that more so than anything else. Max Colville lacks PlayStation passion. He doesn't know anything about PlayStation's history. He doesn't know anything about PlayStation gaming. I think he's just doing a job. They hired a face. They hired a, a radio personality instead of putting someone in that position who cared about PlayStation, who cared about the PlayStation podcast, who cared about what PlayStation means to fans. PlayStation has a huge fan base, and you put a guy in control who doesn't really care about it, it's kind of a spit in the face to Colin and Greg, and it's a shit on the hat to people who listen to the podcast. Now the podcast has been diminished so much. I haven't listened to it, honestly, in the last three, four months. I haven't even listened to it. Maybe, maybe even five months I haven't listened to the podcast at all. Because they have put me off so much with the new direction that the podcast is gone. None of the fan favorites that Colin Gregg used to do are, are even on the podcast anymore. You know, the Andrew Goldfarb Memorial. None of these things are even there anymore. They've got the news ghost, which is so lame. You guys can't get lamer than that, you know? Marty Sleva, he doesn't even show any kind of affinity towards PlayStation because he also hosts uh, Podcast Unlocked, the Xbox podcast. You can't serve two masters, man. I know you're doing a job, but for people who are PlayStation fans, they want you to be a PlayStation fan, not halfway PlayStation fan, and just go right over to the Xbox podcast. Ryan McCaffrey, he hosts that show. Very seldom would he come over to PlayStation podcast. Very seldom has he done it. Colin and Greg, very seldom would they ever go to Podcast Unlocked because they're PlayStation fans. So you can't convince your audience that you're a PlayStation guy when you're 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 you know shitting where you sleep. 
You know, you shouldn't where you eat. You can't do that. And so it, it comes off as disingenuous to me. Uh, Brian Altano is okay, you know, as one of the new guys. He's okay. I mean, he's a likable character. He, he's knowledgeable. You know, um, he, he's made some really great points on Podcast Beyond. I like him as a character. Uh, um, Jared Petty. I like him a lot. I've liked him since Colin and Greg. I mean, the guy is a very likable character. He went through a, a you know bad situation with his wife, a car accident. Everybody's okay, but he's knowledgeable. He 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 loves the games. He talks about old games. He talks about what made PlayStation great in his mind. You can't get Max Scoville to tell you one great thing about PlayStation's history. The guy is a radio personality. He doesn't know anything about it, and so. I, I stepped away from Podcast Beyond because of these reasons. Because Marty uh, is not a PlayStation fan. He's an Xbox slash PlayStation host. Mar- uh, uh, Max Scoville is full of shit. I don't like him. He's a reject from the kids in the hall. He wants to be funny, and he's not. And, and he just wants to talk. He wants to talk. He wants to talk. And he has nothing great to say about PlayStation, and it pisses me off. Jared Petty, great guy. He knows about PlayStation. I think they should have probably put it in his hands because he knows more about PlayStation and he's informative and informed on the subject. Brian Altano is a great guy. I think he also is a good addition. Max and Marty. Marty, you let me down. I know you let a lot of other people down who listen to Podcast Beyond. You should be ashamed of yourself. And on that note, Colin and Greg must feel the same way because Colin and Greg just recently announced their new podcast, the new PlayStation podcast, the return to fucking form called P.S. I Love You. And it looks like it's going to be awesome. I know it's going to be awesome because the guys who made Podcast Beyond so fucking awesome are doing it. So Colin and Greg have been watching Podcast Beyond. You know they have. And you know in in, in the, the solace of their own home, when they're private, you know they are bashing the shit out of what these idiots have done to their podcast. These guys are terrible. Colin and Greg, I know you're not going to say it, but Max, these other guys on this podcast have destroyed what you guys have built for all these years. It's over. And so they decided to do a new PlayStation podcast called P.S. I Love You. It's going to air on September 29th at 9 o'clock Pacific, 12 o'clock Eastern. And I will be listening to it. Thank God that a podcast I used to love so much is returning. They have taken the name of something great and turned it into something terrible. And now Colin and Greg can give us the, the, the rebirth of Podcast Beyond that we've always wanted. Thank you guys so much, Colin and Greg. Uh, I don't know if Tim Geddes or Nick Scarpino are going to be on it, but if they are, they're welcome because they work so well together, you know, as the um, kind of funny crew. So if they're going to be on it, fine. As long as Colin and Greg are there and their passion is PlayStation, which we all know it is, I'm super happy about it. I will never again listen to a podcast beyond. It is not what it used to be. It has lost all sentimental value to me other than the fact that I can listen to reruns of Colin and Greg. I hope you guys enjoyed the gameplay. Way off in the comments, let me know what you think. Uh, do you like Podcast Beyond as it is now? Do you think it's a diminished version of what it used to be? Do you think it sucks like I do? That's me being totally honest. I think the new Podcast Beyond sucks. P.S. I love you. I'm so, so happy for it. I think it's going to be a great return to form. You guys let me know what you think in the comments below. Has Podcast Beyond kind of fallen off in your mind? Did you give the new podcast a chance like I did only to realize it's unbearable it's really unbearable to me listening to to Max Scoville trying to be funny every 30 seconds everyone laughing at the same time over an extremely garbage ass joke is so frustrating to me it, it, they, they drift away from PlayStation so many times they talked about Xbox on the PlayStation podcast it sucks ass I'm super excited thank you Colin and Greg thank you from all your real fans and friends as you guys call us you guys let me know what you think in the comments below and be sure to give a thumbs up show support of the Beastly Gamer channel and if you're new to the channel subscribe today I'm the Beastly Gamer and I'll see you guys next time